Welcome to Tech Trick Tutorials and in today's video I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make a truce on Worldbox. Now have you ever noticed even though two countries aren't allies at all but instead they chose not to like attack one another even for centuries to come. Now this is a phenomenon that's called a truce within the world box community so let's plant a couple of tribes here for reference so in order for you to do this there's no there's no uh, button to press for the truce but this is actually how it happens so first and foremost let's just go ahead and plant the tribes here so for those of you newbies out there civilizations especially uh, on world box start off as tribes and then tribes annex each other's territory and then eventually they turn into kingdoms and then kingdoms eventually had revolutions into modern countries so uh, right now that's what's happening here a uh, tribal war and uh, tribal conflicts are necessary for the modernization of your simulation okay so pretty good those tribes have now risen into kingdoms right here and there's how many kingdoms is this we have two divided kingdoms here as you can see from the difference in color here on their roofs so i believe this is an, a race of dwarves right here dwarven kingdom and uh let's just see what happens because eventually you're going to start conquests and here you go so I'll speak of the devil that's a conquest right there you see those red things that pop top in their leader's head that are in shape of swords that means they're ready for conquest ready for war this one just declared war on neighboring country I mean a uh, neighboring kingdom here and uh yeah basically the goal here is to annex the territory so Oh, we're having a large-scale war here, guys. Look at that. A world war. So these kingdoms are now... This is where it's actually crucial to just let this... Let this all... Naturally fade through time. Because through time, alliances are going to be built because of this. See? Countries are getting larger and larger. Became, became superpowers. But, uh... Most importantly, the point of this video is for the truce, right? So if you don't get an alliance, if you're not going to get an alliance, you're also get, going to get a uh, truce, okay? So a truce basically means even if they're not, they're uh, not ally, both countries, they still won't attack each other as time goes on, okay? So it eventually occurs when a country surrenders voluntarily from from a uh, conflict so it's sort of like a voluntary surrender from a particular country this one has turned into an incredible superpower here look at that annexed all the tribes no longer a tribe here no longer a kingdom this is an entire country here guys and neighboring country here on the side yeah modernization still going to war these simulants are still killing each other over resources yeah, yeah that's one of the key things that they fight is that when you turn off the resources unlimited resources people would go nuts in the simulation the simulants go nuts and start conquests and that's what's happening right now so right now for now we haven't seen any signs of the truce yet but let's just fingers crossed it's going to work okay let's just wait for it to actually happen yeah, I model this up on a global scale at a small scale because it's a little bit laggy for the tutorial if I use a larger world. Okay. A larger planet. 
So let's just turn this all up. Again, it's created by why not let just let them all have it. Okay, let's declare war in all simulants here. So that we could get the truths as early as we could. Okay, so it's only you could get the truths like an alliance, like a basically like an alliance, but the truth is a little bit more indirect because the truth is basically like even if they're not allies, they'd still not attack each other and prefer to help each other's country directly through military means or through proxy. Like they give resources and stuff. Here we go. The world is going nuts here. Yeah, let's just slow this up a bit. Let's just take a little bit of zoom here. Yeah, so far so good. Yeah, this one. They, they're killing each other here. Look at the border clash here. Such a small country, the yellow one here. Border clashes. It's landmines here. Yeah, let's just wait for the truce here, but at least you guys already have an idea of what the truce actually... How the truce is actually attained. Okay? So... It's not a body that you press here in the menu. It's just an indirect way to actually do this. People are actually dying here on these uh, border clashes. So, let's just zoom out a little bit here. Okay. This one has really turned into a global superpower. It started out as a small tribe into a kingdom and now into a country. It's a small country, this one. Man, the border clashes are still ongoing. The scale of this conflict is rising and rising and rising. So far, oh, here it is. Underneath here is the truce. That's the exact truce. Man, they've conquered the north side of their country here. Now they're a single country now, but that's the, tr that's the peace sign right there. And once you've attained that, the country that attacked it first is going to dictate to uh, really essentially implement the truce. Okay, so they won't be attacking each other for probably millennia at a time. But even though they're not allies. So that's just it. So thank you so much for watching Tech Trick Tutorials. I hope this video is educational and you guys have a nice day.